and welcome back to my channel today I'm doing a haul video so recently I've been doing a lot of shopping but by like a lot of shopping I mean like holy shit my freaking wallet hurts so recently I've been going through my closet and tr just trying to decide like which things I didn't necessarily want anymore and I would sell it either on Poshmark or I'd give a bag to Goodwill if you're interested in checking out my closet you can check out the Poshmark link below so because I've been selling stuff I've been adding stuff to my closet and that's what this haul video is subscribe so to start this out, I'm going to show you guys my accessories first because I have less accessories. I was really excited about this. Finally, I got one on Poshmark. And this is a Jennifer Haley Fringe Mini Bohemian bag. It can hold so much stuff in there. Mary Poppins bag. Fringe is kind of my shit this year. So the first two pairs of sunglasses that I got are right here. And they are Karen Walker sunglasses. So the first pair I got, these ones are my favorite of the two. I would say Star Wars, but I don't think these are very Star Warsy, But they're cool. These are called the Star Sailors. And then I picked up this pair, Super Lunar. And if you guys know or follow me on Instagram, I wear those big Karen Walker black sunglasses all the time. So that's why I got two pairs of new Karen Walker ones to try out. Then also with my Poshmark credits, I originally went into Bloomingdale's to try on some sunglasses that I saw on Poshmark and I went in to try on the Dior Abstract but then the lady at Bloomingdale's was like try on these pairs. Then on Poshmark I found them and these are from I think the new season. These are the Christian Dior Dior So Real sunglasses and they're in like the brown lens and so these are my new brown sunglasses. I'm like, Ugh. And because I'm a shoeaholic just as much as I am a sunglassaholic, I can tell you guys already that these ones are my new most worn shoes, probably for the upcoming winter. You're like, wow, Sarah, black boots, cool. These are the Jeffrey Campbell Joe lace up boots and they go all the way over the knee. They're in like this alligator kind of print, so badass. And these are like my new favorite shoes. They're expensive, but and I've been recently kind of into like the more pattern booty trend. Snake fruit was the way to go, I guess. Typical, almost kind of cowboy-esque inspired. I, I don't know. I think they're cool. So that is all of the accessories. Nine minutes. Are you serious? But the first thing I got that were clothing related, I actually purchased this off Poshmark because you can find a lot of previous season stuff from like free people and everything like that on Poshmark for like discounted. And so as you guys know, I have this sweater in red. I wear it all the time. And so I wanted it in blue. So I got it in blue. Another thing I purchased from Poshmark was this blouse and I have this also in red already. Call me crazy, but doesn't this remind you guys of Vera Bradley back in the day? <sighs> That's what it reminds me of, which is a little weird. Did anyone else have the Vera Bradley backpacks, which like had the drawstring and it was really cool not to like put like the flap. And then the last thing I got from Poshmark was this. You guys, I wore this on election day and it still has the uh, I voted sticker on it. This is not a political video. How cool is that? It's from Wild Fox. The next things I'm showing you guys are from Free People, of course, because that's my favorite store to shop at as well as where I work. So one day I was working with my friend, like we were both like, I'm in the mood to buy something. I pulled this thing out and I was like, I'm gonna try this on. And then it ended up looking so badass and I just, I don't know. <laughs> I bought this fur jacket, which is so soft and just cozy. And it's one of those good like layering pieces cause it is technically a, like a light jacket. Oh no, I just really like that. <laughs> I actually got this in an extra small instead of a small because it's already like a fluffy jacket and I didn't want it to look like too like. And then I also got this dress which I recently wore on Instagram. I got this on sale actually. It is like this mustard color and it's kind of like a midi dress and it's got these huge sleeves with like this embroidery on it. And it was once again an impulse buy at work because we only had one of them but it just looked so cute. Look at that. Like how... About a month ago, I actually purchased another one of those suede dresses, but I went down a size this time. I got it in extra small because it fits a little bit more snug, just a little bit more fitted. Really pretty rose color to wear for Thanksgiving. I, honestly, these suede dresses to work all the time into meetings and stuff just because it's so easy. I'll be linking everything in the description box, but this per in particular is just on sale in this color at so many places, so. And the last thing from Free People I got was this dress for the upcoming holiday season. It is just like a big tunic dress and it's so simple. And the really cool thing about this is like you can make the sequins go up and then they're black by simply like 
going like that. It's fun and it's not too dressy and I think it would look really cute with the boots that I recently hauled. And finally, the things that I picked up from Chicwish, like those really fun websites that a lot of bloggers do stuff for. They actually sent these to me. This is not sponsored though by any means. And this little sweater dress, oh my god, it's so cool. It's got these like extravagant, really dramatic like bell ruffle sleeves and I just love it. I think it's so cool. And then I got this white dress that also kind of has that same bell sleeve feature and I thought this would look really cute with the black boots that I was just showing you guys and also snakeskin boots just because it can kind of be like a more formal dress but I think like by pairing it with those boots it's just gonna look a little bit more casual. And then I got this cardigan which I love. It's just kind of like window pane grid type things cardigan just an open one the only complaint though i do have about this is i thought it was going to be a little bit longer so that concludes this extremely extremely long haul video i hope it wasn't too overbearing a little aggressive but as you guys know i love filming haul videos for you guys because they're my favorite kind of videos to watch and thumbs up if you agree as always stick around by subscribing and also be sure to check out my other social medias i would deeply appreciate that and my Snapchat because I've been doing a lot of snapping recently. So if you want to join the fam, it'd be pretty cool. Until next time, I hope you guys have an amazing Thanksgiving coming up. And a happy holiday season. Bye.